Hey guys, so I'm going to show you how to make the hairball centerpiece. It's really simple. We're going to start on Photoshop. I would recommend you to rasterize the image right now because layer is going to come in the way. Then we are going to go to our marquee selection and we're going to take the eclipse one. And while holding shift on our keyboard, we are going to drag the mouse with the left um with the left button and this is gonna make an even circle so we're gonna drop it like this and then we're gonna go to edit the image and we are going to select and oh, I mean select option and we're gonna go to the uh, invert selection and this is gonna make all the rest of the the outside of the circle highlight or uh, select it in a way or you can just do Control shift i um, That's what I was saying about the rasterize. I just totally forgot. But after you do that, it's going to select the outside of the image. And that way you can trim the circle as you can tell. That's what I did here. Pretty simple step. Then we're going to double click on the layer and we're going to uh, use stroke. I'm going to use this color with the, uh, with the uh, sampler. And I'm just going to adjust the width and save the image. I'm going to save it right here as an image for web. And this is going to give me a preview on what it's going to look like. Now I'm going to go to Warpad and I'm going to take the image and put it in here. I'm going to drag it to one inch. And this is going to be pretty much how I do it. And then next time I'm going to print them out. I have different ones here because I was going to make another herbal. So I got two images that I'm going to print out and I'm going to go ahead and take it to my printer. I use regular uh, card stock paper and it's better, it's firm and it does, it's not so translucent so it works better for my center pieces. Now I'm just going to go ahead and print them out. I don't do anything special. I just click print pretty much and... Um, you can also write letters, whatever you want. Uh, I have several methods that I'm going to show you. And it's not just print it out because sometimes you don't have Photoshop or you don't you don't really want to mess around with that that much. The next thing I'm going to get is this um, epoxy uh, circle. I bought them online. You can find them on eBay for really good prices. So I'm going to uh, remove them and stick them on top of the image. Uh, sometimes I leave a little bit, uh, leave a little. I leave a little left out, but it's fine. Um, as long as the image, you can see the image clearly. I didn't measure it right this time, um, but usually it's okay. It works great. The other thing you can use, they have this little um, stickers at the dollar store, or if you find a good sticker, you can use it as your centerpiece too. I found these at the Dollar Tree. So I've used them. They're nice. They are perfect size too. As you can tell, you can make a couple center pieces from here. And uh, the next thing we need to do is just cut them. You can use a one inch cutter or that's before you put the epoxy. Or you can just get it with the scissors. I don't have the one inch cutter, but this works great for me. I don't use it that much. So I don't I don't feel the need to invest in one right now. So it doesn't it doesn't take that much time from me. And that's why I use the scissors. And um yeah, you do the same thing with the uh, sticker one. As you can tell, they look nice. It makes the image pop out a lot more. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this one too. And another thing you can do is use the uh, bottle cups bottle cups for the hairballs um i have a couple i also got them on ebay they're really cheap and they're colored or if not on any hairball store as you can tell there are different colors and uh glossy i mean they're really nice and you can use them either um inside or out like i'm doing it here Another thing you can use is this glitter um, foamy. I, I've used that sometimes because besides this glittery, it gives another texture to the herbal. I, I just get them with texture, scissors, and it works great too. You can use it as your centerpiece. 
and this is pretty much what it looks like and I don't know it's really simple I know I've been asked to make this tour for a while I just I had it before I just didn't have a chance to edit it but here it is another thing that I found at the dollar store is this cool book of stickers it's perfect to make this it also has as you can tell the center the circles like this it's a really good find and you can make it out of anything that you can put on a circle pretty much I like to measure it first just to make sure that it's gonna be good for it um, but like this 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 squares for here for the images are perfect you can see the image clearly and they have different characters too I pick Minnie Mouse because the herbals usually turn out pretty cute when it's Minnie Mouse but um yeah I just wanted to show you that you if you're out there at the store if you see a couple of stickers that you like you can just get them and make in a centerpiece you don't have to deal with the Photoshop and editing and all that it's a good option for you out there and I hope you like this tutorial don't forget to check out the other videos that I have for you thank you for watching let me know if you like the tutorial um, and don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share it was really cool if you do and I will talk to you next time thank you very much for watching bye